Hello. Sango here. Welcome back to my channel. I recently lost the pity for the engulfing lightning, and instead, got another everlasting moon glow. So I decided to see how much improvement Kokomi gains from refining this weapon. Before we begin, please like this video, and subscribe to my channel. My Kokomi is at level 90, with the following stats. She is equipping the everlasting moon glow, at level 90, and at refinement levels 1 and 2. For her artifacts, she is equipping the 4-piece Ocean Hued Clam, with an HP Sands, Hydro Damage Bonus Goblet, and Healing Bonus Circlet. She is at Constellation 0, and all her talents are at level 10. <laughs> First, let's see how much damage she gains during her burst. <laughs> Next, let's see how her healing performs. <laughs> now let's estimate the damage from the sea dyed foam. This is the outgoing damage, not considering the target's physical damage resistance. Here are the results. As we can see, the difference in performance between refinement levels 1 and 2, is practically negligible. The biggest gain goes to Kokomi's normal attacks during her burst, which increase by only 3.2%. The takeaway here, is that refining this weapon by one level, will provide you with no more than 2 or 3% damage gain on average. Therefore, if you're a free to play or low spender, and if you happen to get one or more copies of this catalyst, do not refine it. Best save it. We never know what new characters Mihoyo might bring in the future. This takes me to my pro tip. Unless you are a whale, spending hundreds, or even thousands of dollars in this game, do not ever refine 5 star weapons. The gain in performance with refinements might be useful sometimes, but replacing a 4 star with a 5 star weapon on any character, will give you much more value. When I was an early player, I got 3 copies of the Primordial Jade Winged Spear from the standard banner, and made the mistake of refining it to level 3. Now, instead of giving a 5 star weapon to 3 of my characters, like Shogun, Rosaria and Xiangling, I have only one 5 star pole arm to use. Thus, you should only refine any weapon, if your characters already have a solid choice, and if refining it would give you a significant increase in value. I hope this helps you in some way. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments below. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you next time.